the challenge that we faced, uh, you know, last year with with the weather was uh, one of the, one of the major things that uh, was on time deliveries. It's important to keep the OEMs running, and you know, with logistics uh, lags and stuff like that in some of the runs, it, it uh, you know caused us to ramp up our our services in order to to maintain the deliveries to the plant. So it affected the the whole supply chain. Um, right from start to finish. On-time delivery for, for us is key. If, if the product's not there, they can't, ma they can't manufacture the vehicles. So if they're not putting vehicles together, then you know, they don't have the product, then that's thousands and thousands of people within you know, miles of the plant that they won't be working today. So you know, that, it could be one part that they can't put together that, that uh, is gonna cause an issue. Uh, yeah, the changes that we're moving forward with are, are visibility, right? And, and to have that visibility, uh, you know, from the suppliers, from the from the uh, logistics groups, mm -hmm. uh, to, to uh, maintain that service to the plants. Visibility is is the big thing, right? So now that we know who, you know what to do in those situations and, and to have contingencies in place is is key and important for us as an organization to to have that visibility, to understand what we have to do in those situations. Now with the with the Mexican border being added and and the growth in Mexico. Uh, we know a lot of freight is, is coming up our way, and uh, that's going to be something that we're going to key and, and, and want to be part of uh, in seeing how that is actually flowing. We don't want to see a, a lag in delays and stuff like that, or how can we help our company in, you know, when the freight is coming in, you know, what challenges are we going to see, are, we gonna, are there going to be issues, that type of thing. Uh, the challenges with dealing with Mexico, I guess, is the, the time. We're, we're, he, we're used to the, the time period, period here being, like I said, hours and minutes and seconds type thing, and down there the, the time seems to be in days and weeks. That's, that's uh, sort of the scenario that we're, we're seeing.